Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to another episode of Star Wars Coffee. In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at a leaked set image for the Ahsoka Tano Disney Plus series. That's right now on Star Wars Coffee. The Ahsoka series is probably the most anticipated series behind the Obi-Wan Kenobi series and The Mandalorian Season 3. Ahsoka Tano first made her debut in Star Wars The Clone Wars, the actual film, and then in Star Wars The Clone Wars, the series, and became quickly a fan favorite character. She's also made appearances in Star Wars Rebels, as well as, as you guys know, The Mandalorian and The Book of Boba Fett. She was the Padawan learner to Anakin Skywalker, a hero of the Clone Wars, and she grew from a headstrong student into a mature leader. However, we do know that her path was different than that of a regular Jedi. But what was really cool to see is the fact that we got to see Ahsoka Tano and Luke Skywalker in the same shot, having a conversation in the, in the book of Boba Fett, and that was just... That was so awesome. Did not expect to see Ahsoka in this series, so that was absolutely awesome. But what we're going to be taking a look at today here is this image that has been floating around that some think is real and some think isn't. So I thought what we would do is take a look at it together and you can be the deciding factor and I'll just do some commenting on it. So, points, let's start out with why it could be real. Number one, looks like a desert scene. Pretty Star Warsy to me. Number two, the mall outfit looks pretty spot on. Like, at first glance, when I first saw this, I was like, oh my goodness, that's Ray Park. And then, although it's not a super high quality image, if you go in a little bit, uh, you can tell that this is Ray Park's outfit from Solo. So, when we see him in Solo at the end there with Kira... This is the same outfit that he's wearing, so his Crimson Dawn look there. But, point against would be the fact that this is an option to just put on a mall costume and do some heavy makeup. You know, if this was a fan film or something. Because a good mall is made with the makeup in terms of the look. And, given the fact that this isn't a super high quality image and that this if this was a fan film I would say that they did a great job on it now uh, Ahsoka looks great the length looks great um really what 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 the big question would be to me is these cameras here because when you see these cameras the question becomes are these high quality enough cameras for what a Disney Plus show would actually be using and I am not equipped enough to, to know that answer however another reason against this would be the fact that we have a bounty hunter just head chopped off on the side over here um, helmet looks like Boba Fett clearly it doesn't appear to be what it kind of looks like to me is a bit of a Cobb Vance look, but even that is a, is a stretch. It just doesn't give that off. But clearly, what, 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 what we can see here, though, is that if you look at the cameras, that's not in the shot. And then if you look behind the cameras under the tripod, there is something else laying over by the rocks that I can't quite make out what that is. But another point for it being accurate would be the hilts of Ahsoka's lightsabers look pretty good. The skin coloration of her character looks pretty good. Uh, this does look like a Clone Wars bit of armor, and if she is going to be in the Ahsoka series doing some kind of flashbacks, that would make sense for this, but where does Maul fit into that entire storyline would be the question, because it would have to be a flashback, because we know that he's no longer alive um, post Star Wars Rebels. So the question would be, this must be around at the time of Solo if this is in fact real based on Maul's outfit and whether or not that is Ray Park. And here's another point for it. 
is we know that this show is supposed to start filming sometime in spring, of which it is now. So this could be real for that reason as well. Uh, it's just going to be tough to find out unless we see the series and we see Maul in it or we get better leaks that corroborate Maul being in it. Um, but let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section down below. I am really at a toss up here. Um, if we could have some high quality images like, you know, really like a 4K image of this thing, we could zoom in and see whether or not that's Ray Park or not. Um, but let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Thank you guys for watching. May God bless you and the force be with you always. If you enjoyed this episode, and frankly, even if you didn't, don't forget to subscribe. Do it! And if you want to help spread the word, please give this video a thumbs up and tell your friends to subscribe. Please check out the official Star Wars Coffee merchandise, and don't forget to check out all of the content playlists on this channel, including The Rise of Skywalker, The Mandalorian, and much more.